I think we're streaming. Is it live now? Live now, probably. Okay, I gotta check my... Uh, no one's here yet, though. Let me see, check my... It's so bright. Uh, my stuff. What stuff are you checking? You know what we could play? What? WWE 2K22. No. I could show you amazing matches. What's your thing? I could show you amazing, cool, what's super cool thing? matches. And I could play them out, and you can be like, oh, well, what's the deal with this? That's your thing. That's not my thing. Hang on, let me check this. Are you just checking your list? Yeah. People showing up. People going Saturday night. We got nowhere to be. People probably watching in, in the bars. That's what they're doing. They're in the bars right now. And they're like, they're oh. in the bars? Yeah, I'm going to check this. Check this. I'm wearing my that. mask. I'm wearing my mask. I'm going to check this stream, see what's going on. I don't know about that. You don't know about that? My Steam, my Steam wish list. Your Steam wish list? You're going to have us download a game? So, hey, everybody. What's up? So, basically, Elise was like, let's stream. I was lying on the couch. Okay? I was lying on the couch, and I was just on my phone playing Marvel Puzzle Quest. And Elise said, let's stream. And I said, what is stream? And she said, we'll figure it out. And I said, what does that mean? So, Elise, what does it mean? Oh, I always want to play scary games. <sighs> scary games. Uh, let me see. I'm checking my... Where's the light switch? I need that. Can you, can you snatch that for me, please? Um, Stream Marvel Puzzle Quest? Maybe. Maybe if it comes to that. Uh, that looks pretty cool. Look at that. That's good ambiance. Um, so Elise is now sitting here. We could play TikTok a tale for two together. Is it, what is it, single player? It's two player. What is it, split screen? You and your friend are trapped in a mystical world. As time ebbs away, you must solve increasingly complex puzzles to, to escape. Cooperation is key. Is neither of you oh, play on two devices, local or online? Mm. Hang on, hang on. Mm, let me Kathy see. B says watching the Willows play scary games is best Saturday night, especially when you're at the bar, right, Kathy? Chilling at the bar. Nobody's at the bar. Maybe. Maybe they are. Maybe they uh, aren't. I feel like I'm centered and you're off center. Yeah. you are taking up a lot of That's a camera life. That's not me because I'm big. Ooh, at dead of night. No, wait. Have we played that? Did we play that on Funhouse? Maybe we did. I don't know. Don't remember. Uh, uh, there's also... Let's see what we got. There's also... Oh, hey... Juan, thank you. Juan. Here at Angel City Brewery watching you guys. In Los Angeles? Downtown in the Arts I like District. Angel City Brewery. That place is a good place. We haven't go there been sometimes. in a while, but yeah. haven't been in a while, but it's That's a cool. great place. Um, watching it I watched I told you they're out in the bars. Juan knows. What about this WWE two K twenty two? Is that a scary game? I, mean, I could download Michael Myers. <laughs> Um, uh, I've been telling Elise that I, she's like she's like you should just stream something and she doesn't say it like that. That's me so. Um, Morbius watch party. Mm, I don't know. Um, and I'm like I'm like well I do play so I'll play WWE 2K22 but I'll just try and have really good matches with the computer is like my fun thing to do. I feel like I'm a veteran wrestler and he's a and the computer's a young wrestler and then I'll be like whoa 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 slow down there bud. Oh, you don't go for your finisher yet. Hold on, let's work something out. Let's work something out. And they try and put on good matches. Uh, what about a recorder stream? What does that mean? You playing your recorder? Wexley, the spaceman, says you just play do a recorder orchestra. Mm. Poop Nuggets just finished dinner. Well, if you just finished dinner, you know what's gonna happen next. Poop Nuggets. Poop Nuggets knows. GTA online stream? Are you crazy? This well, looks to delightful. To here, just waiting for release. Talk to people. You know with this couch pulled out, you could easily Dude, do Martha puppets. Is, Martha is dead. I could, yeah. Oh, my elf puppet. Hayden. Hayden, <laughs> thank you so much. so much. It's so nice of you. <laughs> like here. My elf puppet. Oh, then you just looked... Uh. Oh man, Sean! No, you save that money. No, you're not stuck at home. Uh, COVID all week. Don't spend money on us. You got COVID stuff. Don't spend your twice. money on vaccines or something. Oh yeah, Sean! Please treat yourself. 
At you least can, you're not out at the bars. You're not, at least you're not out at the bars. Oh, Shattered, thank you so much. Look at this. From Alaska, wow. Look at this. Don't knock twice. This looks cool. <laughs> you won't. How big are these games? Because we're going to have to download them. I don't which know. Which are going to affect the stream have? quality. What do you have? What do you like? Uh, what do I have? I have Chips Challenge. Chip Binding Chip. of Isaac. I have Counter Strike. Dragon Ball Fighter Z. I have this game called Exit Strategy. I don't even know what this is. Live Condo Update. I have Fuser. Golf with Friends. Guilty Gear Strive. Uh, Half Life Two. It Takes Two. Jackbox. We never finished It Takes Two. We never two. finished It Takes Two. We do have a bug crawling across the screen. Uh, of course, Marvel Puzzle Quest. There. Mr. Mr. Prody, thank you so much. <laughs> Teases by two two by two one dollar games to stream. We should look on itch. What is this Funhouse? <laughs> we should go on cheap uh, games categories. Oh, right. I like scary stuff. Oh, I like scary stuff. All right, so look at the scary stuff. Horror. Look at the scary stuff. But new stuff. I want to play something new. New horror. Something new. Something that's going to make me scared. <laughs> what about It Simulator? It's got to have a good reviews. Okay, all right. Dread X Collection 5. Um, the Last Man. I like it. It's got to be something. Something for the movers and the shakers. Forsaken Barn? No, we gotta look at the reviews. You gotta look for stuff with good reviews. This says two user reviews. It's not enough. It's not it enough. It was made in Unreal. It's not enough. It's not enough. Um, we'll die alone. What's prognostic? <laughs> prognostic? It's got a lot of... Okay. Very how much positive is, How much reviews? is this game? 552. Oh, come on. We gotta get prognostic. Come on. All right, we're getting prognostic. Purchase for myself. Thoughts on the new Arcade Fire album. I like it. I like it. It feels more like it harkens back to albums like Funeral and Neon Bible. I like it. But I think I, I, I don't know that there's ever really been a time where like I haven't liked anything that they've made. What about when they all crammed in that one room and did one of their songs with Jimmy Fallon? Oh, oh, oh. Did you like that? Oh. I like them. I like you get the call right now. Ring, ring. Hello. Jimmy Fallon? Do they want me? They want what? Me Jimmy? Yeah, I'll do you it. You want a lease for Fallon? Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, of course. Yeah, of course. And she has to wear shoes on her hands and, and gloves on her feet? Uh, Is she still on board? Simon, no. I, I don't Fallon. think it's funny. I got um, I w Yeah. Yeah, I'm on. I'm doing the show. Okay, with your hands on your feet and your feet on your hands? Book me. Okay, all right. Um, so full of food. So five minutes five minutes to download this, everybody, just okay. so you know. Of course, I just want to reiterate, we could have been playing WWE 2K2. I could have shown you all the cool matches that I can do. People want to watch Pee Wee Perkins on Funhouse. We haven't recorded any more Pee Wee Perkins, spoiler alert. Just so you know, I want everyone to know that before we started the stream, we asked if John Smith wanted to join us, and he said no. He had to go lie down. He had to 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 lie down. Paddington watch stream? Should we just watch a movie and just tell people to, to like, the Pentaverate? Should we just watch the... The, the Pentaverate? The Pentaverate? I, I don't... I... I Always forget what that. Hey everybody! Is. You guys want to do a pentaverate watch along with us, <laughs> starting at episode three? Does that sound like fun? Uh, um, you we know we have to play this game now. I spent five dollars and fifty two cents on it. Okay. 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 So it's downloading. It's not even close. So just keep, you know. Oh, Bob, Bob Reith, do you actually want to watch the Pentaverate starting at episode three? Oh, come on, guys. There's a lot of talking about my freestyling. Who? 
Alana once said she thought my freestyling was good. It's not good. <laughs> it's not good. It's not good. But James and I, we've been trying to write a musical about that astronaut that wore that diaper and almost... Yeah. Because I'm a hundred miles from home. Nowhere to go beyond where I roam. Well, okay, there's another song called Reach for the Stars, but it's a metaphor for her pooping in her pants. Because it's, you know, remember because she wore a diaper? That's a big part of the musical. Because I'm driving all night, no time to stop. Well, how's the game doing? Don't worry about it. Oh, I so I'm bad. driving all night, no time to stop. Uh, thank God I remembered to put on my top. I'm a hundred miles from home. I know I should bring back the trailer show. We can't. Because those videos get flagged. Even when we just, anytime I try to watch a trailer on this Rinky Dink channel, it always gets flagged and demonetized. Yeah. So we, uh, doing Marble Mondays on Funhouse, mm -hmm. which is such a fun series to do. And we did an episode for the Hulk gang game. However, we talked about She-Hulk. We speculated about She-Hulk when we recorded that video. And then almost immediately thereafter, the trailer for She-Hulk came out. Well, I believe, if I recall what happened was I expressed disappointment at her size in the original one. Then the actual trailer came out and I was even more disappointed. Did you know Marvel? Did you see the thing that said recently that Marvel said that they had to constantly give feedback to the artists and say, make her smaller, make her smaller, make her less muscular. Are you joking? No. Mar that's re reports came we out recently. We want strong women. We want strong women. Ugh. Look at this. That could have been She-Hulk. Look could at that. Could have been She-Hulk. Look at that. Forced perspective. It, put, it looks bigger. I put well, it as bigger. you know, I couldn't possibly be with someone who isn't mostly muscle. All right. That goes for friend and lover. All right. Of which you are both. <laughs> and I'm a hundred miles Rachel. from home. Thank you, Rachel. Um, Juan says, "How about James practices WWF moves on World Wildlife Foundation moves on Elise?" He said, "WWE." Oh, it did say WWF. Oh, yeah. Juan, come on! You must be drunk on your Angel City Brewery. Um, I'm a hundred miles from home, driving my way, moving this chrome. Did James ever do a review of Morbius? Well, you never saw it. Is that what I have to see. You have to see it. You know, I just I've been busy. I haven't gotten around to it. What? Watch Morbius? I just, I feel like I've, you know, there's been a lot going on. You know? I have just so much has come up. You know, I, it's a top priority. I assure you. It's a top priority, you know. Michael, thank you. And I'm sorry that you needed this today. Um, maybe, maybe Michael was having too good of a day. And now, it's like, I really need this to bring me back down. Oh. To really, like, bring me back down. This is a little stone. I found it. I hope your tomorrow's better. I found it uh, in my trunks. After I went swimming in the ocean. And I found this in my trunks. Do you think the compression inside your underwear made it like a diamond? Speaking of compression in your underwear. I'm a hundred miles from home. Filling my the diaper. The does come out on June 10th. I think we're probably going to stream it at Funhouse. Because I'm filling my diaper. Nowhere to roam. I'm a hundred miles from home. Oh, boy. All right, hold on. We're going to have to do some uh, graphic settings here. Okay, hold on. Hold on, everyone. Hold on. Let's see if I can... Well, this is on her phone, but she's paying attention. Um, I just check on something. Is there a musical? Did we get the theater? Jack Stewart wants to know: Are you guys psyched for the new Top Gun? Yes. Heck yeah! Very I, psyched. I put on uh, the I put on um, original Top Gun today, so I can watch Did the you? beginning again. Yep. <laughs> Elise, Elise, and I have been toying. With the idea of uh, starting t doing TikTok sketches. Because we always do things at home where I'm like, oh man, I'm just put that on TikTok. She's so like, funny. that'd be such a funny TikTok sketch. And I go, yeah. 
That wasn't funny. Oh my god, I just realized what we should do. The right. game's downloaded. We're going to start playing it in a second. But Can you grab those for me? Okay. Fang Li, can you do Alien Isolation next oh. time? We didn't we, we I think we had years tried ago, streaming we, that years, years ago. ago. The game was real hard though. It's not a bad suggestion though. What uh, watch is that, James? It is a Samsung watch. Matthew Hennis. Hello, James Lee. Hope you were well. I hope you were well as well, Matthew. Thank, Thank you. you, Matthew. Thanks for chilling. Are you guys going to watch Chip and Dale Rescue Rangers? We did. We watched it last watched night. Watched it last night. Yeah. I appreciate the attempt at doing this generation's Roger, Ra Roger Rabbit. Mm -hmm. I thought there was some fun stuff in it. Look okay. at James' crop top. You mean just because you can see my belly poking out the bottom? <laughs> Come on, guys. It's not a crop top. Quit picking on me. Um... Yeah, I, I mean, I love the Lonely Island crew. I think yeah. if you tried to make a movie like that with any less talented people than them, it would have been pretty bad, but I, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. You know, um, I'm an asshole and I nitpick sometimes, but I enjoyed it. Don't make that face. You're supposed to say, no, you're not, sweetie pie. You, you're supposed to say, why, you're the cutest little... Um, pop star Never Stop Never Stopping is like one of the funniest comedies. Um in the last decade it's very like, definitely underrated because oh. i think a lot of people like the it has a reputation which isn't that it's an amazing modern comedy because it's about something so insufferable you know like you think about like dude pop star or whatever and you're like oh it's probably insufferable but it's such a great thing and the music in it is amazing it, it has is. some of like the best songs uh especially comedy songs and you know me i'm not big into musical comedy so we're going to play prognostic, <laughs> but I, so I don't know if I should do a bit with this or if I should just come clean. Mm. So I was in a little, uh, uh, Japanese shop and they, uh, they had these Jojo's packs, Jojo, Jojo animation packs. And you know, this was probably a year ago and, um, the, I was, everyone was opening Pokemon cards at the time. It was a big thing of people open, opening uh, Pokemon cards. And so I was like, I'm going to get packs of these. And I'm going to open them on stream. Nobody wants these. But then, and then, and then Alyssa's like, okay, you're actually going to do that? And I was like, heck yeah, I'm going to do that. It's going to be great. And then I, they've been sitting uh, over there for, you know, like a year. So maybe I should open the pack now. So I have four packs. You were going to do a whole thing where you were going to do like, yeah, like make a mockery of it. I was going to joke about it. So, so let's do it now. Let's do All it right, now. Let's do it. So we're going to open this first pack. Um, I don't have the top down camera to do it. I was going to set up a top down camera, make <laughs> it all serious. So let's just assume. Um, why are you, yeah, why are you so unshaven? I don't know. I just haven't shaved in a while. This is about as thick as it gets though. I can see you in the camera there. And then my whole thing was I was going to go, I was going to go, what the heck is this? <laughs> what are you gonna Chocolate do? wafer? I thought these were going to be JoJo's cards. Uh, that was it, my whole thing. I knew they were wafers. So I had a pretty, pretty good. And I was like, I, but I was going to do this. Like, what the heck is this? Chocolate wafers. El Chile says pack opening hype. And I go, I go, well, what about this one? And this is what I was going to do. Gonna, well, hold on. Maybe check this one. It's a way for two. <laughs> what the heck? I can't resell wafers. There's another wafer. The heck is this? I got two more packs. They can't all be wafers, can they? What is the Japanese wafers? I'm sure the next one. It's wafers. Come on, baby. I need to get the resell cards. Come on, baby. Please, I'm gonna show you. You tell me, tell me his cards. Please tell it's me his wafer. cards. God wafer. damn wafers. Actually, give me, are these still good? Are they expired? Uh, can you read no, Japanese? I should, I should not eat anymore. Can you read Japanese? It has Bandai 2021 made in Japan. I shouldn't eat anymore. Anyway, I was gonna do a whole bit about it. Oh, it does have cards. It's Kira, the serial Kira. I'm How do I get? 
This is. Oh, you get little cards. Yeah. It does have little cards in each one. Come on, please, please. It's mostly wafers, but maybe at least one of these will be Josuke. Yes. No. No, it's not. I can't eat a wafer. I, I eat so much. Jotaro. Jotaro Kujo. Who's your favorite JoJo? I don't know JoJo. If you had to guess. I, I, think, I, watched, oh! I think I watched a little bit of JoJo. Because JoJo does... JoJo t tells the story out of... Like, the, it's different time periods, right? Yeah, it's like a family. It's like the lineage of yeah, the family. I, I, no, I don't really know JoJo. Um, I watched... What, what's the season with Kira? Is that four? Or is that three? Mm. I'm asking them. <laughs> I don't expect you to know. I I like Joseph Joe Star. He's my favorite. He's the most fun. Too. And him going and fighting all the the uh, oh. the stone men. That that's my favorite favorite arc of it. Um, and then and then I do like the season after that uh, where they travel the world and they do that. But then the season after with Josuke. Um, where they're in the weird village, couldn't... I, I finished it, but I had a really hard time. I had a really hard time swallowing that one down. I didn't understand that. That's good. I said Josuke. Um, Josuke. And so... And then when I started the season after that, it seemed like it was going to be more of the same, and then I just kind of like... I was like, I can't do this, but... All right, anyway. Now that... We're playing this game? I finally did this. Thanks, guys. Thanks for letting me... That was a year in the making. You're in the making. Well, no, it wasn't a year in the making for anybody. They didn't know that you were doing that, so... You guys have been waiting this for a whole year, and the payoff has been huge. Except for Trish. I'm okay with these cards. Wish guys, it was Joseph. Stop asking about Morbius. The only Morb we have in our lives now is 30 Morbid Minutes. Can I we told move? you. I told you I don't want you promoting your trash on this stream. <laughs> trash. Okay, whatever your hobbies, whatever your, your the swill you're drinking or whatever, we don't care about that, okay? People are here to talk about two things, scary games and Joseph Joestar cards. Oh my god. No, go ahead. Kathy B said 30 more minutes is sick. Because it makes her nauseous at thinking about it. <laughs> I'm going to start playing this game. You want to start playing thank this you, game? Thank you, people. I'm going to screw around with that. Nice. Uh, uh, podcast. John Smith said that he refuses to ever listen to 30 good for more him. minutes. Good for him. <laughs> uh, tell me, how's this? Oh, there's languages here. I'm how's the volume for this game? Sean wants to know when's the next workout stream? Last one was great. Great question. It takes a little bit of setup. Um, I'm not sure, uh, but I will. I will try and do one eventually again. I've been training AJ, who was in our last stream. I've been training him for a while. Um, and he keeps going like, he's like, you're so gentle with me. People could really learn from you. And I'm like, I appreciate that, AJ. That's very nice. But That's really sweet. It is. Yeah. It is very nice. But I'm like, I also don't, I don't know. It's tough. I don't want to mix pleasure and business, you know? But anyway. Um... Okay, we ready to do this? Scary game? Let me know how it sounds. Colin Smith, can you give me the elevator pitch for 30 Morbid Minutes, Elise? 30 Morbid Minutes is a podcast exploring the morbid, macabre, dark, and downright grisly when it comes to topics, people, places, and events in history and the headlines my of brother, today. And I was sitting in As a hosted bedroom, by myself and, and Jessica listen. Vasami. We heard the knife stab Jeffrey Williams says, James, were you in a San Marcos the gas station a few years ago for some reason? My roommate swears he saw you. Where's San Marcos? Yes, I was there no pumping money, full diesel <laughs> into the back of my, <laughs> I think it was a Ford F-150 <laughs> diesel edition. That was me, six foot five, 243 pounds. Uh, blonde streaks in my hair. No, I don't know where San Marcos is, and I've never pumped gas there. Your roommate is a liar or mistaken, but I'm leaning towards the former. She's going to read the story. She'll tell you about it. 
what happened to our parents. But later, it was always shows. later. It's when will we be nice ready? For me. My brother was the first one to escape. Closer. He joined the police force. I left her after. I, like my mother before, did not respond to her letters. They were just another promise to reveal some secret if I came back. Can we just all when agree stopped, that, like, I sighed with relief. 1880 Finally. to like 1930 were just scary times. Grandmother was killed, stabbed with a knife. Was there an the echo? The robbery. The voices of my parents came That's back. probably because they can hear us or hear it over the game. Oh. Uh, Our town is eating it itself. Down. Where's your mouse? Yeah. Comes for it's our in people, the game. for my oh. friends. I, I can't yeah. take it anymore. Uh, CR Nun, have so you had Baldur's and Cheese? Balderdash Cheese? I don't know what Baldur's and Cheese is. Is it a brand of cheese? Is it a type of cheese? Andrey Bulanov. Oh, my, he clicked out? Yeah. Where's the, where's the mouse? Elise, will Peach Harvest make a revival soon? I was thinking about that the other day. Are you? Yeah. And what did you think? You said maybe? Never say never. It has to come. It basically has to come. Wait. Left mouse button to interact with items. Oh, okay. Turn it Lindsay. <laughs> Lindsay's here. She said <laughs> dinner and a movie. My God, Lindsay. I feel so sick. <laughs> Every day I send you new pancakes. I'm so Your tired. Is... What? Lindsay, this are you playing complex. World of Warcraft with Jacob? Seems. Oh, that's what we should have played is World of Warcraft. Andrew, can't get this to work. It did work. Hello. Thank you so much. Leonardo, 30 more minutes is the best. The sleep paralysis stories were insane. I would like a 30 buffest minutes pipe. 30 buff Later. minutes into. Oh, who well, are these? Thank you. Who are these dweebs? Lindsay's waiting for Jacob to come online and play WoW with her. <laughs> That's that what I should do? Should I download WoW and play for the first oh time on gosh, stream? Oh my gosh, Lindsay. Maybe she don't want you in her Oh build, yeah. In her uh, something build. tells me she'd be like, I'm absolutely <laughs> gonna play. Go to the next room and find the ritual candle. Press F to light the path with a lighter. Hey, Lindsay's not always burping. Is this a puzzle game? What did I download? Okay, in front of the party, make sure that the ritual candle is lit. Put the person's dossier next to the map. Choose the time of the calendar, year, month, however the divining rods are going to close it. The rods will, the rods will spin if the, the ritual candle is gone. Okay, well, we need to get the ritual candle first. I lit the ritual candle, I think. Are you guys keeping up with the hockey playoffs? Not anymore. Oof. Not that the Leafs are out now. I want to look for this boy. Lindsay, you want to make Lindsay a moderator or whatever? Uh, sure. Congratulations, Lindsay. <laughs> She's like, I don't want it. <laughs> <laughs> You've been cursed. Oh, no. Lindsay. Oh, look, my things are spinning. Is this on 30 more minutes? D divining rods? Yeah, my divining rods are spinning. Oh. Oh. Oh, there's a bug there. Nope. <laughs> Lindsay said wow, but I don't know if it's a good wow. Um, with that, okay, all right. yeah. What if she does become corrupt with the power? Name Zachary, age, uh, I Savant says, Lindsay, the hatred between you and Patrick gives me life. We were talking about this at dinner. Uh, age 15, date of birth. Patrick is mean to all the women in the office. Oh, come on, without prejudice. No. That's not true. Patrick is a gentleman in every sense of the word. And if you debate that, you're a liar. Okay? There's no way. Patrick couldn't hurt a fly. Not that he wouldn't, but he couldn't. All right. We're ready to light some incense. You should know about all this. This is all your occult. Doors of all ritual rooms are marked with clues. Was stomach gurgle? Was that your stomach? I thought that was the game. No, that was my stomach. Because we ate room. all that cheese and that meat and stuff. Evan, thank you. Evan wants to know, what should I paint next for you guys 
for Ari house party. Can you paint uh, Evan? First if you would be so me. so kind to Patrick being mean to Lindsay and Charlotte and I. <laughs> me being mean to to Lindsay, Charlotte and me. Oh. Oh. Lindsay said I could probably oh. break Patrick's arm as easy as breaking a pound Lives of spaghetti. In a... <laughs> Lives in a workhouse nearby. Oh, Very quiet, yeah. Look at his eyes. I don't know. That's why I picked him. He's got weird eyes. Press tab to find out the time of the crime from the case. Enter it into the calendar. Because I'm a hundred miles from home. Uh... 14th of December. Okay, so f- December 14th at 1 p.m. 1902. Got it? God, it's December 14th at 1 p.m. 1992? What year was it? December 14th at 9 p.m. Mm hmm. December. What year? Is it 9 p.m.? You went on 13 hour. Uh, I think it was 13. What year was it? Was it? 1902. 1902. Oh, I was, I was wrong about a lot of that. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Oh. All right. After finding the culprit, you may return to the hallway and fill out the report. It lies on the table. Adil, hello. Thank you so much. Oh, Jake, Lindsay says, gotta go check this online. Oh. Red alert, going to Azeroth. <laughs> much love, food coma. I'm so Where's stuffed. Where's my divining rod? I am so stuffed. Oh, there they are. I'm so stuff. I hurt so much. Oh, Andre, I apologize. I'm so sorry. Uh, please ask. Please get a refund. <laughs> please so ask YouTube to refund you. It was here. That's, I apologize. It happened here. Pronunciation. How do you div- divining rod? Do they when they touch tips? That's a, that cancels it out. Bye, Lindsay. Have fun. Bye, an Azeroth. Jeff Delgado. Hello. Hello, Jeff. Oh. How do you submit stuff to Ari House Party? Jeff. You just put how, it up. Forget House Party. Most, I, I, 90% of what's hanging in our home was done by you. Okay, so. Um, this, what is this? Number seven? Jeff, have you watched RRR yet? Okay, all right, okay. Make sure that ritual can Night No sleep. Day says, I'd Put pay good money for two Bordas Helvids a week. Maybe if we streamed on Twitch more. You've, you've always said this, James, that yeah. if we streamed on Twitch more at Funhouse, then uh, we could do some more Bordas Hell. That's just, you know. Oh, yeah, for Funhouse? Mm-hmm. Yeah, for like longer, wilder just, games. It was okay, Jeff. I only heard that it's something short of a masterpiece. What was just okay? RRR. Oh. Wow. Okay, so you live here. Greased, Greased U4 Deaf Guy says, been watching y'all since early Inside Gaming days. Wow. Uh, thank you for watching for so long. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> that didn't sound good. I can't burp. I find where all the... Oh, why is it light? What's happening? What's that mean? What's the light flicker mean? What happened? I don't know. I'm trying to solve these mysteries by looking at a map. Fry. And the prognosticator. Prognosticator. What are you trying to do here? What's the point of... I'm trying to figure out where these boys live. I need to sleep. I need to sleep. Now? Gotcha. Okay. Um... Jake Paulson. I figured out where they all live. That's what's that. Choose the date and time. However, depending on the closest to the rods, the closest to the place where the person was, the rods will spin. Okay, so. Humden says, I'm loving Marble Mondays. I love making Marble Mondays. It's really fun. Submit the culprit dossier. Clues? Okay, so he tells me where they lived. Personal case. Where did the crime happen? I live on the first floor in an apartment at 2 Meadow Street. <gasps> Harrison Hawkins. It's Harrison Hawkins. God damn it, Harrison. Don't even think about deceiving me. I know who did it. I just want to test you out. So, 
Deku. Wait, so... Make an... He's the victim? He, well, go back, because he, he says, Make an invocation to the souls of the dead and tell me, O oh, great steer, which of the neighborhood kids broke my window. I'll send you a oh. description of them both. There's like the ones the old woman worked. Harrison uh, Hawkins did it. Is he the says? Is he? Did he? Because he said... Description of them. One of them committed this terrible crime a couple of years ago. I live on the first floor in an apartment on Two Meadows Street. So this is the person that's this asking this. This is the person this. that's dead? It's the person that... This is the victim. He's speaking to us from the death. Right? He wants to know which of the neighborhood's kids broke their window. Okay, so he lived there, so that would have had to have been his window. Submit the culprit dossier. Kathy Divining B. Rod's going wild. Kathy B says he probably won't notice, but just in case, could you please say happy first birthday to my dog, Goose? Happy birthday, Goose. Goose. Your brother is a police officer. It brings me great pleasure to wish you a very happy bark day today. I know that Kathy is a wonderful dog parent, mm. and uh, I hope you have the most delightful birthday together Submit the culprit <laughs> dossier send a clue about his location during the crime uh a clue oh my heart i don't know what i'm doing Michael wants to know how Magnus the spider's doing. How's Magnus doing? Well, we put him in the living room on a potted plant and haven't seen him since. But I will say this week that he's been in my bathroom, I usually see him in the mornings. So it was kind of getting into the afternoon at this point in time. So perhaps Magnus had taken a sojourn. Good night, Alex. Cause I'm a hundred miles from home. Okay. Mm. So I did the ritual. I'm for some reason living this. You returned old, to the hallway and filled the report. It lies on the table. Did you do that? I did, but I don't know what it's asking me. Oh. Look at the city. It's full of blind. It's full of the weak. Protect them. It is full of sinners. Punish them. Like I don't know how I'm supposed to figure out who did it. I figure out where they all live because I did their little clues or whatever. Yeah. But I don't know what, how I'm supposed to tell who who did it. Someone said, don't forget to spin it clockwise. Spin what clockwise? My dowsing rods? Mm. See? They touch tips right here. That means I nailed it. Does Funhouse still do drunk Mario Party videos? We just did on Friday. This is a s switch sports, but we just did it. We streamed it. We streamed it. So, like, I mean, I figured out where all they live. Find the culprit. You may return. I don't know how I'm supposed to figure out who who did it. William, I, thank you so much. Um, WWE. Where is the report? I don't know. What I, Tab brings up this. You've been watching this old woman go crazy through all her childhood. Now you want to take her place? This is the one in the hallway What are you talking doing? about? That well, you to fill out? fine. Do you want me to help you? Then let's conduct a small test. Make an invocation to the souls of the dead and tell me, O oh great seer, which of the neighborhood broke my window. I'll send you a description of them, just like the ones the old woman worked with. If you find out who did it, then we'll talk. One of them committed this terrible crime a couple of years ago at this exact time. I live on the first floor in an apartment at Two Meadows Street, and don't even think about deceiving me. I know who did it. I just want to test you out. Well, but where is the the what they're saying? Go to the hallway. Go to the report in the hallway. Where is that? Because we're not in the hallway right now. Yeah, the dossier. Is that thing? Is this thing over here? It's this. Okay. And that's where you like submit. So, 
Just put something in. There's, I can't. I don't have a clue. Oh. Hmm. So I, I don't know how to do the other thing that I'm supposed to do. Hello, DJ Chili. Chill Wonka or whatever. Sorry, I can't see from here. I'm worried that I might not be the right person for this job. <laughs> if I can't solve this case. Oh, there's another room. Oh, this room's creepy, huh? It's the same room. So what would the clues be? Are the clues just another boy? I mean, I don't know. I guess... I feel like I'm supposed to infer something. It just says dead there. What happens when you click on it? When I click on this? No, not the... But the one up there? When, oh, it's yeah, just it's to just... leave a marker. Oh... Or the, is the clue one of the other kids? That's dousing rods. That's to zoom. I mean, I put that up and I can see where they, he lives there. I hear a mouse. I can put up the picture of this boy. I'll put up a picture of this boy. Oh, my thing's running out. Son of a single mother. He doesn't go to school during the day. He works as a janitor in a bar. Appreciate his desire to help his mother. But this is not the place where a child should grow up. Eric, thank you so much. The son of the owner of hairdressing salon. Very quarrelsome kid. Very active boy. At least I'm worried I'm not send meant to be a, a psychic. Send a clue about his location. How do you send a clue about his location? During the crime. Like that, I don't, I don't. How do you send a clue? Um. In order to find a person, do the following. Make sure the ritual candle is lit. Put the person's dossier next to the map. Choose the time of the calendar, year, and month, date. Hover dividing rods over the map. The closer the rods, the rods will cross in the place where the person was. The person will spin if the ritual candle has gone out. Place the flag on the right address with the typo in it in order to add a clue. Uh, thanks, citizen. I mean, I think I solved it. Pretty sure I solved it, bro. It's this kid. There. But then... Send a clue Can you about type his. Type in there. What happens if you click? Oh, the clues are on the right. So then, what do you click on the right here? I just click them again. Oh, we did it. Okay. We solved it. The clue. It was Harrison, the janitor boy. I should have known all along. Okay, all right, here's another problem. I was allowed to take part in the preparation for a major court hearing on the outskirts of town. French potato, thank you. At 18 Barnhill Street lies the Fulton Farm, home for a closed and deeply religious family. As it turns out, they were too religious. Earlier this year, one of them murdered their youngest as a sacrifice. All the Fultons now cover the murderer, but only one of them made the sacrifice. I don't know who was in the house. Try using dowsing to find the murderer. All right, we got to figure out where they live, which is there, 18 Barnhill. Oh, man, look at all these people. Inbred. <laughs> all right. That's a poor boy. Poor, poor dead boy. All right, okay, let's, let's do this. Like that. Now we're in. We're in the ghost realm. Oh. Is this a scary game? <laughs> I think it's supposed to happen. I don't know. Dousing allows you to f find out a feature of a killer. Oh, okay. Place the victim's case on a stand. 
Walk around the house. Crossing rods will indicate the direction to the object. Okay, so we have to do this. I feel like a Ghostbuster. Gonna point hey, Ethan. Out. We're doing well. How are you? I'm pretty tired because I ate a lot tonight. <laughs> if I'm being honest, that's where I'm at. Oh, what happened? What'd you do? What'd you do? I don't know. It just made the noise. Be careful. Don't scare everyone on stream. I'm not trying to scare everyone. We're going to walk around the house and figure out Come on, dousing rods. They're not dousing. Oh, what is it looking at? The clock. Memorize it and return to the dousing room. Okay. This yep. game is prognostic. Is that what you have to get when you're like in your 40s and you're a man? Mm hmm. So you got my prognostic checked. All right. Uh, decipher the meaning. Clocks. Murder is 30. Murder is 30 years or older. Age is 30 years or older. Got it. Okay. You heard that knock, right? No, what knock? Uh, age 29. So it's not. Uh, not age Alicia. 28. 62. Oh, could be Annabelle. Could be Conrad. Could be Conrad. Could be Annabelle. Okay. All right. Whispers indicate that one of the mirrors has been opened. The dousing rods will point the way to that mirror. Close it as soon as possible to get rid of the intruder. Uh oh. You burgled this mirror fast. Oh, there's a mirror. There's a mirror. I don't like mirrors in video games. It's like. Now like you are on your. Own, solve the case. I didn't see anything. Oh. Like mirrors and horror games? I don't, I don't like that. What else am I supposed to... Oh, I got it. Okay, I got to use the map now. Right? Oh, I don't like this, Weezy. I don't like this. <laughs> Mm. Gotta run around this creepy mm. old house. Mm. You hear that? That's just dog. Dogs outside. are barking. Kathy B's dog's birthday. Oh no, Mr. Funky's scared. I don't like this, guys. All right, I gotta figure out where they were. Where was she? On the day? What was the day? Eighteen Barnhill Street. That's not the day. <laughs> Uh, Barnell, eighteen Barnell. It was her. How do you know it was her? It was her because she was there. It was Annabelle. How do you know she was there? Because I used the rods. Um, well, watch out for her. Cause Annabelle did it. She's an intruder. Which? Annabelle did it. Is she gonna be pissed? <sighs> what? I was given only one attempt to conduct an interrogation and your tips were not enough to get it through. I'm sorry, but we'll, we won't get access to the archives anytime soon. It was okay. her. She was there. Okay. She was there. 
Uh oh. So I just keep going. I'm failed. I'm failing my way through this. Uh, oh no, it's the same thing again. So you just have to do it faster? No, I. Or there's gonna be a surprise now, maybe. I don't know. Oh god, this is. Okay, so. Those mirrors not gonna. Is your phone buzzing? So Conrad and Annabelle were both there. Oh, thank you, Michael. The whole family was there. Okay, all right, the whole family was there, got it. Where was Luke? Okay, he was there too. Okay, all right, well, we knew that, okay. All right, fine. Rods are spinning, my rods are spinning. Okay, so up here, put a picture of the victim, and now I can douse. Robert says maybe you need to say that the other guy is not there. It's a clock. Okay. All right, it's a clock. Memorizes meaning. Time. Time signifies age. Clock. No, I think it's, yeah, it's, I mean, it, it does signify this. So that's hidden up. I don't know, want to know what intruders means. Okay, so we go over here. We look at thing. Is the thumbnail for the stream Venom related? Uh, it's Mrs. Chen. <laughs> Walk around the house, find out which object to rise, memorize the object. If they're out there starting to rotate the ritual candle with six things light up, find out the meaning of the item and mark the killer's feature on that nearby list. There's a clock, 30 years or older. There, marked it off. Okay. Murder's 30 years or older. He was there. It always shows this little kid's face. All right. Um, send where the killer was during the murder. The time of death is marked in the victim's dossier. Oh, that, okay. I see. I see. Whispers indicate that one of the mirrors has been opened. The dowsing rods will point to the way to the, mur to the mur mirror. Close it as soon as possible to get rid of the intruder. Ooh, you gotta find this mirror. I'm trying. Uh, I hear whispers. Uh, uh, is it around the corner there? Oh, there's a mirror. Oh, you gotta cover down mirror. The thing. Oh yeah. Okay. That's not good. All right. Okay. So the time of death is January. <gasps> oh no. Oh, the Knox. Who's Knox? January 8th. At 11 o'clock. 1904. How do they have Polaroid at that if it was 1904? So the boy was there. Okay. How do they have Polaroids of these people? Where's Annabelle? Polaroids. I mean, she was there. He wasn't. Conrad wasn't. Where was Conrad? Where was he, that old bastard? He was over here somewhere. They're flickering. Why is yeah, it's because of it's because it's, I'm running out of magic candle. Um, okay, so she was there. So it was her. I was right, but I just didn't do it the way they want me to do it. Okay, so dossier. Send the killer's dossier. She was a killer. And I don't know why she has a picture of him. The murderer is 30 years or older. Send, with, send his or her distinctive feature. And then. 
She was here on the date of the murder. Case closed. Good night, Sean. I heard something terrible today. I just heard a woman blaming her husband for not being able to kill his own grandson. Annabelle had to do it herself to appease the voice of God. This case gave me an idea about death of our grandmother. The strikes of different people should be different, right? I studied the autopsy results of our grandma and found a couple of oddities. Each stab was weaker than the previous one. In the course of the struggle, such as a clear pattern is impossible. The direction of the blows also doesn't match up. They are too similar and weird. Knife strikes were aimed at the chest area, and the blade was directed not upwards or downwards, but almost perpendicular to the body. Maybe she was killed in her sleep, and the whole robbery was staged. If so, then someone was trying to disguise premeditated murder. Who wished her death? I will try to find the last people she spoke to. I'm a little worried about this intruder. You know? Thank you, Mr. Pipes. Mr. Pipes. Sarah, thank you so much. I hope you're having a wonderful night. And a good weekend. That's Ultraman. Tough. Hey, James. Any tips for someone looking at Swole for their first time in their life at 27? Oh, 27. You got time 27. To, oh, my gosh. You got so much time You're to get You're going to kill it. You got plenty time. of time to get Swole. That was the um, best time. I would say find a program, number one. Find a program that you can track to track your progress. Number two, understand that part of getting big is eating big. So I would recommend tracking your calories. It seems like a really lame thing to do, but it'll make all the difference in the world. Um, and uh, something I would advise is if you're trying to get big, um, like you're trying to build muscle and stuff like that, um, don't overdo it, but just understand you have to consume a lot of calories. You have to eat a lot to really gain size. And then afterwards, you can uh, you can basically like cut cut that weight off too so i don't know find a program uh there's some great youtube channels renaissance periodization is a great channel that has a ton of information um do something you enjoy Jeff doing Nippard. too what that my, my suggestion would be do something you enjoy doing too that's active well but if he didn't care about activity he said he wanted to get big wanted muscles okay it's not I about swing, what you like to do i swing kettlebells that's what you need to do yeah it's good it's good exercise but I like the swinging motion. That's fine. That you're still doing resistance training. All right. So we got another case. A school teacher died of a heart attack right in the middle of the church. This case kind of. Boo! Thank you so much. That's so so kind of you. You oh, really don't have to do thank that. Thank you. It's so so generous of you, and super, super sweet. Thank you for for watching us for years. Find the killer's lost you Mark where the killer was during the poisoning. It happened one hour before the murder. Okay. The perpetrator and the victims had to be in the same place. And two of his features. Okay. I'm worried for you. I'm worried for you. Yeah, I might. Is that from in the game? No. I'm just worried that I'm not going to be able to hear the whispers. I can't tell what's happening. So let's see. The victim died. Okay, he died of a heart attack. So the headmistress, of course, do you know? Local school teacher died of a heart attack right in the middle of the church. The headmistress of the same school had died of a heart attack at the exact same hour. Is that what I just read there? Yeah. Yeah. So another coincidence too. There's another coincidence. The headmistress corresponded with our old woman for the. <laughs> the headmistress corresponded with our old woman for the last several years. That they were poisoned an hour before their death. Okay. So this would be twelve. Twelve January twenty eighth, nineteen oh four. You gotta block that person. Twelfth January, what was it, twenty eighth? Right? Twelfth January twenty eighth, nineteen oh four. Okay. And so Well Chenum chatter tonight. Well yeah, cause uh so he was there. So 
Let's see. Oh. Do you think there's going to be a Morbius sequel? No. Oh. How would you know? You haven't seen it. Yeah. She was not there. Oh, my heart. Remember when, when uh, Matthew McConaughey did that whole like that? Like, yeah, mm, Wolf Wall Street. Mm, I can't do it. You know, but he did it. But he should be on cocaine to do it. Okay. William said James is killing this game. You're Am I? It. You're killing it, boo. Am I? I'm just worried about the intruder. I'm pretty worried. I'm also I'm more worried that I'm not gonna be able Good to night, hear. Robin. Okay, so they were all there. Okay, so every wait. Oh, so it's definitely not Diana Kelly because she wasn't there. All right. It wasn't me. Hey. Yeah. Shaggy. Okay. <laughs> Where's our moderator, Lindsay? She's in Azeroth with Jacob. <laughs> so we have to find an object. Oh. Thank you so much, Mr. Seth. Oh, look at my 30 more minutes decal. It's Jess and Mia's skeletons. Is it a cloth? Put my water bottle. Dinosaur? Good night, Michael. Dinosaur. What is a dinosaur? Hell yeah, there's a season two of 30 Toys. minutes. Toys. But we ain't stopping. Green eyes. We ain't stopping. There is no break between seasons. There's no stop. We just keep going. Train keeps on rolling. You know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh, I think it might have been Molly. The decal is in the store. It's so cute. Hey, William Kirkman. What is this for? What'd you use this for? Oh, no. Hold on. Oh, was somebody there? It wasn't me. Was she coming with the dowsing rod? What was it? Me? Somebody there? I think there was an intruder. Because I saw the intruder. It wasn't me. Just don't put any dang mirrors in your dang house. Thank you so much, Peter. Peter, I really enjoy writing it. It's very fun to, to record. The research is interesting. I feel like I'm writing a paper every single, single time. What the? How am I supposed to be looking for? <sighs> I'm, I, haven't been, I haven't been reading any of this. I I'm trying to it. find what this is pointing at. Oh, Randomly Werewolf. Thank you for watching Kolok. Every Monday night, I do Kolok, an RPG show with uh, a bunch of really, really great folks, and it's a lot of fun. Yes. And I play a character that's very unlike any character I've ever played. <laughs> and it's very fun. I don't know what it's pointing at. Uh, behind? Can you push that, or...? What does that mean? Shaggy. We're gonna assume red dress, or okay. orange dress, or something. What's this for? That was to put the thing under the desk. Do you still need this? Do uh, you need no. To keep this? No, you can get rid of it. What if you ever need to like dismantle Clothing. it? Clothing. The color of the clothes will tell you the color of the hair. Red. Brown. Red hair. Red brown hair. Dress. What if you need this again? Well, you can watch Kolok on yeah. Hyper RPG or Fear HQ, and then Monday nights. It is... The killer has brown hair, green eyes. Live at 6 p.m. Pacific. It's this boy. On uh, Twitch.tv 
slash fear HQ. Who would have thought he was capable? But then you can go, you can also go back and watch the the backlog of um, Uh-oh. aired episodes. Ethan Nestor, Crank Gameplays, he's on it as well. And Alana has guested on an episode. And uh, it is a very, very fun time to do. Okay, so. Are you sure you don't you know, need to hang on? I think it's this boy. Spencer did it. Spencer boy. I think Spencer did it because he was there. You don't need them? He's got brown hair and green eyes. You don't need them? You sure? We sure? Oh, it wasn't Spencer. Send the boy to jail. (laughs) I'm gonna throw it out. That's fine, throw it out. I don't know what it wanted me to look at there. Hmm. We didn't found murder in time. He had brown hair. I said I was right about those two other things. Would you be happier if you played... AW or not AW if you played uh, WWE. WWE. Yeah, put it on. All right, we'll go pivot real quick. We'll do one go match. Full screen. Go full screen on us. We'll do one match. Did you see this message? What? From finding Ilya. Uh uh-uh. uh. James is so funny, almost as funny as Elise. Okay, all right. Well, I'm gonna block that. I I think you're funnier than I am. Spencer was guilty. Hashtag Spencer was guilty. Spencer was guilty. Lock him up. I'm going to have to... Uh, where's my controller? You might like this game. It's it's fun to play like the... Uh, I, only want, I, want, I only want to watch the legends that I know. Russell. Yeah, we can play as the legends. Who do you want me to play as? I'll play as a legend. Mm. Can we do Macho Man? Ric Flair? I want to see... Is Luna Vachon in this game? <laughs> I mean, no, she's not. I want to see Vader. Is Vader in Uh-oh, this? Oh, hold on. This is going to get us immediately. Oh, uh, the music? Yeah. Yeah. Well, mute it. Mute, mute the game in your in your desktop or whatever. Yeah, it's going to come through here. There's a stream mode. Turn it mo- on your there's, speaker, there's there's a, Hold on. I'm gonna, I just want to get into the game, and then I can do it. Joe says, I always wonder if Elise dye her hair or is natural. Well, this is my hair color. Up here. And then some of this is dyed. It's updating my save, just so you guys know. Which I guess is the thing that it oh has to gosh. do. Oh my gosh, moots! Moots! Thank you so much, but it's so unnecessary. We gotta ask, get it, just ask YouTube for a refund. <laughs> that Escape Academy preview the other day was great. Good for a stream when it comes out. I loved it. Oh, yeah. We definitely were like, hey, can can you just let us know when this game's actually coming out? Well, the out? reason that we said, they asked us, they said, would you be down to come in and play this game? And the reason we said yes was because we checked out the game and we were like, oh, yeah, this is like something we would actually play. Yeah. Um, I was going to suggest Vader versus Bam Bam Bigelow. Big Bam Vader? If, if they are both in the game. Computer safe mode is on, so... The music is on too, right? Yeah, but I think it I think because it wasn't loaded up into the menu, it was like Yeah. And so it's just not gonna play any hmm. music now. Hmm. Alright. Let's see. Yeah, we can see what kind of Why does Ted DiBiase look so like wax compared to I don't know that who that is to his right. Brock Lesnar? Oh, is that Brock Lesnar? Yeah. With the beard? Yeah. Oh my god, I guess He's like I... a mountain man now. Wow, I haven't seen Brock Lesnar. Like, to me, Brock Lesnar is always the same look of, like, the shaved crew cut, clean shaven. I don't know, I do not recognize He's him. He's got, he my has, god. like, a top, top knot. Top knot. And I don't, and that, how old's that tattoo? The, the, uh, well, just in case he'll ever see this. The very cool tattoo of a knife? Uh, he's probably had that awesome tattoo for years. Really? Yeah. Man, my... I mean, I haven't seen Brock Lesnar this, though, I don't know. in a while. They but... have Elias here, but it's weird because, you know, Elias hasn't been around for forever. His his brother Ezekiel, though, wrestles now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But Elias is, you know, 
I feel like Ezekiel should be in the game because he's the one who's actually in it. Um, yeah. They have a my faction mode. I don't know how it works. All right, I'm just let's just do some cool matches, huh? I just like trying to play a cool match. All right, let's do a normal match. And let's see, look, look at all kinds of... Do I of... have to play? I don't really want to no, play. No, you don't have to play. Yeah. Razor Ramon. You love Razor. I do. Well, you know, I asked... I said... Oh, they have different era Ric Flairs. Yeah. Ric, Fra Ric Flair. Well, I asked 80. if they had Vader and if they had Bam Bam Bigelow. I think Vader is in a DLC that just came out. Uh, uh, mm. Looking at X-Pac. <laughs> Teddy Biasi. Uh, Tony Storm's in AEW now. Uh, Trish Stratus. Uh, Ultimate Warrior. A ton of different so Undertakers. Many Undertakers. There's this Vader. One, this one's interesting because it looks like he's good. Yeah, there's Vader. Yeah, yeah, put, put Vader in. And All right, Vader. Do they have Bam Bam Bigelow? I don't think they have Bam Bam Bigelow. Sorry. Bobby Lashley. Braun Strowman. Brett the Hitman Heart. Cactus Jack. Uh, Where are they grayed out? Some of them aren't loaded them or in. They're DLC. Uh, some of them are downloaded. Uh, so I, I have custom wrestlers downloaded, but they don't always load right. So I got. You'll notice that there's a a trend with this. Britt Baker DMD. Brian Danielson, The Bunny, Chris Jericho, CM Punk. Dan oh, Dan Housen is who Jake likes, right? Yeah. Dan Housen, Dax Harwood, Ethan Page, Jade Cargill. Don't worry about that. That's a work what? in progress. That's a work in progress. John Moxley, Kenny Omega, Matt Jackson, MJF. I don't, I don't know any of these like new people. Nick Jackson. Well, these are all AW. You know Scorpio <laughs> Sky? I know Scorpio Sky. And Wardlow? <laughs> mm. We don't have to do... We won't do... We'll do... Uh, I Let's see. I wish there was like a... I only know wrestling from 1990 to 1997. You know Hollywood Hogan. You know Kevin Nash. You know Rikishi. Yokozuna. Yeah, put these two titans against each oh, other. This will be a harder match to to portray accurately, but... Dustin, thank you so much. Let's see. At some point, I need to try and do a uh, moonsault. Vader moonsault. And I think his signature... Was it his finisher, the powerbomb? Who, Vader? Yeah. I think uh, he did the powerbomb. Yeah. Has right. James watched Young Rock? I haven't, actually. Dustin, thank you so much. Appreciate you watching. Well, why are we in the Thunderdome or the Battle Dome? It's time! It's Vader! Time, 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 time! <laughs> Apparently he was a big teddy bear. He's a big nice guy. Keep yourself down. Right? <laughs> it looks pretty good. This game honestly like looks pretty wild. In the past they've had you're like, well, I don't know about this, but this looks this is a pretty good look. And they also have like old um, like WCW arenas, and you're like, oh, they like made it foggy. Like those always arenas used to always look just look so foggy. When did he die? Uh, not too long ago, a couple of years ago. Let me see. Twenty eighteen. I I I like thinking about how I never did any of the Battle Dome stuff trying to get on it but i'm really curious if anyone did what sort of terms of service what sort of things that they had to agree to to be in the background of like a show like that because it's almost guaranteed that they were like we're going to be using all this in the video game like but i wonder if these people realize that their their likeness and their image would be used in a video game like yeah uh is is British Bulldog in this? I don't think he is. Mm. Let's skip it. He's got to throw some salt. Alright, so let's try and put on a good match, alright? Alright, Yokozuna? Oh, 
So you have to do the block, hit him with the chop. Wait, so is this like a COVID thing where people are watching from home? This is what they this is what they did, yeah. Huh. During COVID times. Oh, he's too strong. Dallas says Man <laughs> Mankind versus Undertaker, Hell in a Cell is one of the best TV moments of all time. We recently showed that match to a friend of ours. Uh-huh. Whose mind who like didn't doesn't really know wrestling and whose mind was like blown. Matthew says, hi, James. Thoughts on the state of wrestling entertainment, enjoying the promotions and direction, especially AEW? I, I am especially enjoying it. I mostly watch AEW. I watch, like, some major pay-per-views, but I'm really... <laughs> There's a glitch in this game that causes it to speed ramp at certain times. So let's if we walk outside of the ring, I'm curious if it's going to speed ramp. So, uh, I think AEW is great and super entertaining. I watch uh, Rampage and Dynamite every week. Uh, WWE, I only watch like the major pay-per-views. I think it's really great. I think it's really fun. Uh, I think it's a really good time to get friends who aren't necessarily into wrestling into wrestling um, because of how accessible it is. Oh, and we get... Oh, Yokozuna is not gonna do a kick like that then. Here we go. Then they hit it, and then he'd hit him again. Okay. Oh, he's going to the outside. Oh my gosh! Look at that DDT. <laughs> the speed, the speed ramp. Let's see what we grab him. Take him over here. Oh. Oh. oh no. Oh, got him. Look at that, how proud I am. Okay, all right. Ooh. He slides out. He says, not my style. Not my style. And he gets pissed off. He's come on, come on, find me out Billy here. Billy wants to know, how did you discover wrestling, James? My dad watched wrestling. Yeah, I mean, wrestling was just something that was on for as long as I remember, but I, my big thing was my dad watched wrestling. The real two fly, big fan from Queens. Yeah, I yeah, gas is uh pretty wildly expensive right now. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for contributing. Oh come on, Vader, um, get up! I like Costco gas is a little less expensive, and so I've been doing this thing where if I if I get up absurdly early which sometimes i do you know like six in the morning i'll like go get costco gas the last time that i was doing that it was like 6 30 and two fights broke out at the costco gas pumps while i was there i was like this is wild uh, matt davis thank you so much hope he says hope you're staying happy and healthy we're trying same to you matt yeah trying trying really hard too Uh, Six Pistols, what do you think of the new Legacy Incorporated? I don't know what that is. What is that? I don't know what that is either. I figured it was an AEW thing. Uh, no. Uh, oh, God. That's right, I get that free kick out. But now you gotta get up, Vader. You gotta get up, Vader. Oh, no. David Cheeto says that Young Rock has all kinds of cheap knockoff actors of wrestling legends. <laughs> yeah, that's what I've heard. That sounds fun. Oh no. Ooh! I remember when... What? <laughs> Did you see how fast he counted? 
I remember when it was, I guess it would have been like 20 years ago or whatever, but like that 70s show was on. Was it that 70s show where The Rock played like his dad? Um, that sounds right. And I remember it was a big deal because obviously like I watched wrestling and like watched The Rock, but then it was like, oh no, he's, he's on this show. He's acting, but he's acting as his dad. And it was like a thing. Okay. Correct I'm going to fight you. Patrick in Creator Clash. Are you? Yeah, Patrick and I are going to wow. box each other. Okay, I would watch that. <laughs> Do you think he'd start, he'd like, he'd come out the gate, yeah, you'd be playful, he but he'd come out the gate me. immediately swinging? Your mate says, James, don't tell, don't be telling us you're an AEW fan. I love AEW. Way more than WWE right now. Way more. New Wrestling Incorporated is Wrestling Games YouTube channel with their own wrestling promo promotion. Oh. Let's see. Greg, thank you so much. Greg says, Punk or Hangman at Double or Nothing? Mm, I think, I mean, the wrestling guy in me says that Punk needs to let Hangman win to better legitimize his... Uh, to better legitimize him as a champion. But I like I like CM Punk a lot. I like CM Punk a lot. So it's, you know, it's tough. I don't really know what the best the best strategy is for that. <laughs> I don't I don't know how I would book that. I I think I think Hangman's going to win cuz they they re it seems they really want to legitimize their champion, so can't uh, vertical suplex thank you i don't know or remember who that is if they're if they were someone from 90s wrestling james i'd like lex luger oh candice LeRae. who was that i think you've seen her wrestle oh, before she, she, is she a contemporary wrestler yeah yeah oh, yeah i don't know who that is i think she she took some time off for uh because she gave birth to a child recently but um, she uh she's a contemporary wrestler uh i always Lex Lex Luger was like, you know, the right kind of like pompous attitude. Like when he was a narcissist. Yeah, I, I always enjoyed watching him. I don't think that mankind is Philly. Him. Oh, that's okay. I mean, Philly, you don't have to apologize. That's very nice of you. Um, I mean, I just watched wrestling because I don't. I don't really know. I mean, I started watching it when I was. About five, and it was on TV. And I remember I would come home every or every Saturday morning. I either had to go to like catechism classes or grocery shopping with my mom. Then I would come home around noon or sometime before and watch wrestling. Look at all these old arenas. Cause I'm hundred miles from home. Um. You do the hell in the cell? Yeah, let's see if we do hell in the cell. I don't know how. I don't know how to. I've never done this game mode yet, so. There's no mankind. There's just tennis cactus Jack. Yeah, I don't. Maybe he might come in a DLC or something, but. What a chill Saturday night. I, I can't believe I tricked you into watching me play wrestling. I don't. I tried to set the settings so that way I won't do the speed ramping and then count one, two, three in a quick pin, cinematic pin. But look at that. You know what they don't do enough of? Buried alive matches. I loved casket matches. Well, casket match is one thing. They still do that. Oh, they do. But Buried Alive matches, they, they've only done like five Buried Alive matches or something. Because when they get up on the mound, they're like hitting each other on the dirt mound. We, got, we know who it is. Let's see if we hit it. I'm ready for him. I'm ready for him. They send in character. Bang, bang! There he is. 
Bang bang! Can I skip? I wanna break out. Uh, can I break out before the cage comes down? I feel like I should be allowed to. <laughs> he looked into the camera, did you see? <laughs> he spiked the lens. Creator Clash Royal Rumble. Book it. Has, has Mick Foley ever been outed as doing anything shitty or being a shitty person? I don't think so. Cause, like, to my knowledge, he's beloved. Yeah, right? Like, he's written his books, the, and he's like, he does the Santa stuff. and the, the only terrible things he did to himself. Yeah. I think, but that, I don't know. I hope no, I hope there's nothing. Isn't it sad that this is the world we live in? Where it's like, I just hope he, I hope Mick Foley did nothing. Yeah. The gate it's hit me with the, the turnbuckle. See, but that's the thing. It's like, it's like, man, you don't start out by hitting my head against the turnbuckle for a ten count. What do you think this is? And then straight to the bottom of the thing. Okay, well, you're bringing the kendo stick. You're gonna get hurt. That's what you get. Where's that kendo stick? How do I pick it up? <laughs> Arena says at least looks ready for bed. I have to admit, I am pretty tired. Ate a lot of bad stuff for dinner. And it's hitting me. It's hitting me hard. Is it? I was like, I get up pretty early. I get up at like 7 today. Boom! Cracked it right over his back. Oh my god, I shattered it on him. And then see the thing you go for the pin. See that's how this is how you wrestle. You get give the fan the big spot. You know he's not gonna. You, but you gotta go for those pins. Now I have Undertaker gonna take him. And get him with that. Oh my God! Oh my! Oh my Lord! Oh my Lord! Check him out with the boot. Do this, and then I'll walk away and taunt. Walk away and taunt. Look at that. See? <laughs> Do that for the crowd a little bit. And then I go back in, and then I'll let him take control. Oh, he got me! My hubris. But he's still not good enough. He's still not good enough to win yet. How dare... And then it's like, how dare he... Try and do that with me. Nope. Big whip over the top. Pull him out. Get up. Yeah, get up on the cage. <laughs> okay. Oh, ringside like combat. Oh, okay. Thanks for letting me know. See, now it's just like a brawl. Now it's a big brawl out here. They're going crazy. Oh. No big spots, just some brawling out here, right? Pull the me back in. Oh. Okay. That's just me here. Don't fall asleep, baby. Oh, I'm just enjoying watching this. Oh, see, see, but it's like a wrestling match. <laughs> I just like trying to have these like actual wrestling matches. Oh, yeah. he gets a cage. Is he gonna go through? No, he fights back. He fights back and he grabs him, counters, gets him, reverses him, throws him down. I gotta block somebody. <sighs> Can you, uh, I have to click back into the game. But they're out. So they're out of the cage. So after that back and forth, big high spot, they're out of the cage. Did I click I back in? Yeah. He's trying to, yeah, I mean. He's climbing up. They're going to the top. <laughs> this is, doesn't work out for Mick normally. 
Any thumbtacks around? No, oh, a good question. And there they are. They're on the top of the cage. Are you kidding me? Oh, the back and forth. The back and forth. The one, two, three. He's biting him. Oh, he stunned him on top of them. They're going crazy for him because he's getting beat up so much at the beginning. Let's see, but again, if I was playing this match. Oh, no. See, if it were me, I would have swapped it. I would have been like, oh, he's fighting and everyone's like, yeah, he's going to do it. He's going to do it. Then you counter. A big, a big close count. Oh, not even a two count. Come on, bro. At least give me the two. But yeah, I would have had them fight it up on the top of the cage. Then just as you think Cactus Jack is going to get it. Nope. He misses it. Oh my gosh. Jeez. Oh. Dragon screw. What's he doing? We've seen it before. We know what the Undertaker does. <laughs> we know what he he's does. Walk the route. He's walking it. Big drop on him. Tombstone pop driver, center of the ring. Oh, he kicked out a two. He got out of the tombstone. Undertaker is shook. He's quick. He doesn't understand. How can this be? Oh, the desperation act. These two titans going back and forth with each other. Oh, into the referee. The referee gets knocked out, and then he goes for a pin, and he can't get the pin because the referee's knocked out. Uh. Yeah. Well, you see how we have to. We have to make do. <laughs> But in a perfect world, he would have gotten knocked out by the referee. Are there... So, like, you know how, like, um, like Razor and, and uh, Kevin Nash were, like, best friends? Mm hmm Are there any notable, like, best friends? Uh, I mean, yeah. There's there's a lot of people that are friends. And... But, like, best, but, like, best friends. I mean, I guess it depends on what you mean Who by else? best friends. Who else? Uh, I mean, there's a lot of tag team guys that are tag teams that have been, no, that are like actually good friends. I don't know the non-tag team. Who are the best friends? I, I mean, I don't know offhand who you're talking about. Tell, no, I'm asking. I don't, I, I, I'm, I'm telling you, I don't know offhand Aww. like the best friends of wrestling. <laughs> Other than there is a tag team called the Best Friends, <laughs> which are... By their own account, best friends. Matt Davis says, Yeah, you gotta go up to kiss. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that was funny. Okay, drop him there. Oh, okay. Oh, don't slam into the cage. Edge and Christian. Yeah. That's what. I guess. That's what Michael said. <laughs> oh, Rey Mysterio and Eddie Guerrero. Well, Eddie Guerrero was apparently best friends with everybody. Oh. Uh, Finding Hylia says Mrs. Chen and Venom. That, yeah, very good. Dustin, very good best friends. thank you so much. You don't ha really don't have to. Um, Philly says the only bad thing Mick ever did was get caught cheating at a wing eating contest. He ap apologized and said he can't keep up at his age anymore. <laughs> Best friends of wrestling, James. Tell me. I want to know. I, I mean, I don't know offhand who the best friends of wrestling are. Oh my god. Jake and his snake is. <laughs> Damien. I want to know. You should do a podcast called The Best Friends of Wrestling, where each episode is about two best friends in uh -huh. wrestling. 
Look at the Undertaker's calling for it. Dustin says, James, your no gym keep in shape video was helpful. Got work in the morning. Have a good one. Thank you, Dustin. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you have a great night. Just back and forth. It's brutal back and forth. Oh, counter. The Dudley Boys, of course. Again, that's just a tag team. <laughs> tag teams don't count. Okay, I want to know the best friends nope. of wrestling. Who they are. Ooh! I thought we were going to go through. Oh my god, I get up. Counter. Yeah, you go. No! Oh my god. This is not how it's supposed to go. Oh, blocked it! Ooh! What a counter! And then the Undertaker breaks his foot. Thanks for hanging out, Wait, Is he doing the last, the last ride? I'm gonna Google. I'm gonna Google. I'll figure. Google best friends of wrestling. Well, Mark Henry cried when Owen Hart died, so maybe they were good friends. Everyone loved Owen Hart except Stone Cold. Why didn't Stone Cold like him? Because Owen Hart almost bro or did break his neck. Oh, broke neck, his neck. Yeah. That's it. It's over. Diamond Dallas and Jake the Snake. Yeah. Yeah, he rehabilitated rehabilitated him. Um, let's see, who, what, wrestlers were good friends. I think they say were in real life. Because I want to. Because I don't know any of the new people. I I want to see. Um. I mean, yeah. Austin said. Best friends, which are Chuck Taylor, Orange Cassidy, and Undertaker Trent. And Bro Trent? Undertaker and Brock Lesnar. Roman Reigns and Braun Strowman. I, I don't know if they, these are like like what you're looking for. We got four stars in that match. Current, oh, I don't know, current WWE. Klopp says Mankind and Socko. Yeah, Dax Harwood and Cash Wheeler, but they're also just, they're also just tag team. Like, they're like, Best Triple friends H for... and Chris Jericho became best friends. I just don't. I don't know if that's what I know what you're saying that you're looking for. I don't know if that's that's what. Goldberg and Chris Jericho became best friends. Is there anyone from this era that we can put? Mm. Oh yeah, Edge and Christian. I'm seeing them. Okay. Happy Corbin. Hollywood Hogan. This is not the right era, but... Randy Orton and Edge. Randy Orton and... Um... Goldberg and Paul Heyman. Are they? I don't know if I these are know. the best friends you're looking for. Sorry, uh... Lizzie. Let's do Nate. <laughs> yeah, you got a corpse to kiss. I'm sorry. We'll do this. Is our last one Ric Flair versus Hollywood Hogan on Monday Nitro. Hulk Hogan, Bruce Beefcake, well known lifetime friendship. Sting and Lex Luger were friends? Probably. Sting and Ultimate Warrior he's tag team. Whoa, that's supposed to be Ric Flair? Maybe, I guess, kind of. I guess, kind of. Charlotte, North Carolina. Mm-hmm. I mean, uh, Kevin Nash and... Like, Shawn Michaels and Triple H are, like, best friends. They're also friends with, like, Kevin Nash. Um, you're looking for people that were so good at being best friends that they manipulated the back, the locker rooms in their favor, right? 
That's really the kind of best friend you're looking for. Does anyone know? I'm going to ask. Does anyone know if there's a button you can press in this game that causes Ric Flair to get whipped to the turnbuckle and to do the thing where he tumbles over the top and then runs and gets hit? <laughs> I think if they the perfect wrestling game for me is one where there were moves you could do that gave advantage to the other wrestler. Like you could basically do a move where you press it on your end, but then y your character would get whipped or like take a move. Because there are some wrestlers who are just selling is just as much mm -hmm. as like giving, right? Mm -hmm. Especially with Ric Flair. So there should be there should be a button where you're able like one of your moves is to like take a hit and then like go into the corner and then stumble out and fall down. Bluey says, "Hey guys, thanks for all the laughs and positivity. Really helped me through the past couple of years. Anyway, good night, Miss Chen. Good night, Mrs. Chen. Thanks, Bluey." I'm waiting for. I see if that's like not a shirt. That's a bib. You're right. It is a bib. Oh, look at that. Should I get? Should I get a bib like that? NWO bib. NWO bib. Is that what it is? <laughs> it's listed as in the store. Yeah, yeah. WWE store. You get the NWO bib. <laughs> so fun it's so funny to me that hulk hogan was like he had like his second second phase was him <laughs> with a painted on painted yeah. on facial hair i mean rick flair's been rick flair his whole career yeah. but hogan's gone through so many phases oh my god with the drop kick right, right at the, the gate yeah get up get up come on here's a chop yeah there we go oh okay oh no Bro, slow down. What are you doing? Hit me with choke slam the second move? See, this is the problem with the computer. They're, they were get work too worked up. Roll up. There you go. Oh, we roll out. Come on, Rick. No. Oh, oh. He's selling. I'm selling. This counts. Oh, okay. All right. All right. Slow down. Slow down. This is what we get. This constantly telling them. Slow down. Slow down. Okay, so he'll pick me up. Boom, Ric Flair comes back. Come back. He's gonna chop, chop, chop. How's that? Chop. Oh, and then chops him back. That's good. That was a good moment. That was a good moment there. There it is again. Oh, come on. Slide out of there, Rick. Hit him with the chops. In the corner, and go for the pin. Yeah, Rick, because he just wants to win the match. So he goes go for the pin. Oh, kicks out, just throws him right off. Hogan's unstoppable. Follow him up. And watch this. He goes right back into the pin again. He just gonna, he just keeps trying to pin him. He gets so frustrated with the ref. See, and then I would go over. I'd run, talk to the ref. Come on, I'm trying to pin him. Let's do this. And then came in with that clothesline, great. Came in fine, he says, James doesn't want to win, just wants to tell a good story. Are you hitting me with his leg drop? It's like, come on, Hogan. Don't you really try to tell a story here? <laughs> he hits me with... Jeez, come on. Stop beating up on these old men. I am the old men. <laughs> Slow down. Slow Pee down. Pee Pee Perkins only fights old men. <laughs> Is he waiting for me in the corner? Oh, sorry. It's Rick Flair says, I didn't roll away from that. Oh, no. Okay, counter. Slide back. DDD. Great, great. And then do a little... Well, why wouldn't he do the strut? That's such a generic. So it grabs on. Oh, come on. Come on. Take him, slow the match down, let's slow the match down. Get in there. No chop. Give him another one. Boom! Falls out of there. Give him the pin. Oh, come on. 
just uh, absolutely uh, completely frustrated. So he's now taking it out on him. Look at him, he's taking it out on him. Oh. Oh, to the wells a little too many times. So here's what I do. Oh, he's blocking? What is this? Typo? <laughs> <laughs> start switch so stone. Now I start working the knee. Here's where it, oh, he's gonna start working. Let's see, see again, he's, he's, he's playing real stiff with me, but. I'd say that's where I would, that's where I would start working the knee. And then I'd set it up so that way later on I could get him that figure four. So he come out, he's gonna go, let's go get him. Let's get him. Get there, pick him up. All right, let me work you, let me work you a little bit. Let the fans be pissed off. Right in their face. They're gonna be so pissed off. Boom! Take him there. Let's go again. Let's go again. Take another one. Boom! All right. Maybe I go here, drop the elbow on you. Yell at the fans a little bit. I can't face them, but I'd yell at the fans. While I'm yelling, ah, hey, come on. Take him, all right, we'll put him back in. All right, you want him back in this ring? Let's put him back in the ring. Here you go. Shove him in there and go back and yell at the fans. What? That's back in the ring, come on. What are you doing? Let him, let him get, get his stuff there. Get back in. And then Ducks Under. They thought that was gonna be the turn. Not the turn. Backbreaker. Here we go. Now we're starting to work the spots. Starting to work the spots here. Okay. Give him an Irish whip. Someone said that I look disinterested. I think people oh. uh, if I think if I'm not at eleven, people perceive it as disinterest. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, then I'm allowed to just be chill and enjoy something. Boom! See, I'm just hitting him with it. Uh, I don't wanna... Guy, he's getting up too fast. He's not communicating. All right, let's try this Irish whip again. Okay, yeah, he comes back. Good, this work is good timing. He comes back. Maybe be, be, he'll let him beat up on me a little bit. Oh, my guess f f Flail around, flail around. Oh, he's beating, he's beating him. This is punishment for what he's done. Oh, he's putting me in the figure four? What is he doing? But then Flair, so I give him the hit. Because he knows his, he knows these moves. There's a lot of green NWO shirts in the audience. Do you notice that? There are. Yeah, like weird blue are, stuff. Is, <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. Okay, so he's... He gets a you Give him a little spot. I'll, I'll let him beat me up a little bit. Hopefully not too much. Rick, look, Ric Flair's selling. Look at he's selling. He's like a rag doll in there. Look at he's selling like a rag doll in there. Okay. Oh, I mean... Ric Flair to... has always been the king of cell. Oh, yeah. Stunned real good. He's dragging me away from the ropes. Admirable. Flair kicks out. How did he do it? How did he do it? Hogan, Hogan doesn't understand. What does he have to do to beat this guy? What does he have to do? Flair? Flair? We need, we need a reversal coming up, though, at some point. Oh! Oh no, not the leg drop. <laughs> Do you see his Ooh. body? That's bad. I might lose. Oh, rope break, but he puts his foot up. See? He goes for the leg drop. Flair puts his foot up. Now we just need to get up. Oh, he's so he's so mean. Oh, Hogan's pulling him away from ropes because the, the computer only cares about winning. You always wait for the two count. You know, he's is like super uh, interesting, like seeing so many of these men mm -hmm. in con, it like contextually next to one another to see their size. Oh, yeah. Because, like, for me, when I was a kid, like, watching Hulk Hogan, like, he was a big guy, uh -huh. but he was always around other big guys. Yeah. 
But then when I saw Rocky three for the first time, mm -hmm. and he's Thunder Lips, uh -huh. and you see him next to Sylvester Stallone, yeah, yeah, and he's huge, yeah, yeah, and you're like, oh, he's he's a massive man, yeah. But then you would see him next to like Andre the Giant, or like, or then later like Kevin Nash and stuff, yeah. And it's like the whole, you know, yeah. Um, like Scott saying. Hall is a giant man, but then you put him next to Kevin Nash and he looks small. Yeah. Not well, small, but. Flair's going for that pile driver. Yeah, it really wasn't, it really wasn't until Rocky three that I was like, oh, he's a giant, giant man. Sylvester Stallone's, <laughs> not, how tall is Sylvester Stallone? But in this scenario, the ref saw him, kicks his legs off, and squad now he's arguing with the ref. So he goes pick him up. I just think he's gonna get a rope break, but oh, maybe he pulls him away. Oh, he gets the rope break. Flair is pissed. He's upset. He's gonna yell at that ref. How do I? How no? How how, how do I target the ref? <laughs> no, it's. What a, what a domination. What just, this is brutal. This is a brutal match. Hit him with again. Boom! He goes to the well woman too many times, maybe. No, he gets it. Oh, look at that chop of the knees! Is Hulk Hogan, like, completely excommunicated from WWE? Mm, I don't like, think he, so. Like, he doesn't appear at stuff ever. He, as he hosted movie. WrestleMania not too long ago. Oh. Yeah. What's with all these green and uh, double O shirts? Yeah, I don't know. It was green everything. <laughs> uh, what are his okay. Texas Power Driver Sleeper Hold Figure Four? Okay. Oh, look at that! The Ric Flair knee drop right there. Okay, goes for the sleeper. Oh my god, he's got Hogan in the sleeper. Oh, but he gets the rope break. Come on. He goes for it. He goes for the figure four. Kicks him off. Hogan comes back. Big clothesline. He's all pumped up. Look at him. Flair doesn't know where he is. Look at this. Hogan's getting him up. Another big clothesline. He's running Flair through. Don't pin me. Come on, man. Not enough. Come on, you need to, you need to, come on, do your stuff now. Do your thing. Give me the you. All right, he goes for the leg drop. Hits him with the leg drop. I would have had him do the whole punch, 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 knock him, body slam, then leg drop, and then boom. Then I would have ended it there. Because, you know, he goes for the figure four, kicked off. Hogan comes up all powered up. That's what you would want. I would have had... Sleeper hold takes him down, goes down in the sleeper hold. Then we've got him. Then we've got him. Oh, he's, he's out. Yeah, 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 he thinks he's gonna win. He thinks he's got it in the bag. And then, and then of course Hogan comes back up again, tries to do something. Flair chops the knee, goes for the figure four. Hogan kicks him off, and then, and then they have a back clothesline. Clothesline. Flair doesn't know where he is. He's fumbling around, and then goes up. Body slam. Boom. Leg drop. Boom like that, and then that's how I would have ended that match. If I could tell Hogan what to do. But no one can tell Hogan what to do. You Thanks for watching, calling, everybody. You weren't calling the match. I was trying to. I was trying, I was trying to call you it in the ring. The match. I was trying to call it in the ring. Um, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, Stephanie McMahon is on Yeah, leave she's on or whatever, leave. right? Yeah. So, but... By all, by all accounts, from what I've ever heard, she's a very nice person in real life. Yeah. Unless you've heard differently. I haven't heard anything about her in real life, oh. I don't think. Um, 
but yeah. Oh well. That's the, that's what I do when I play this game. Is I just get frustrated with the computer, and I'm like, spy. I'm like, dude, you gotta slow down. Slow down, man. Why are you doing your finisher over two minutes in the match? It's like, what's your deal? But it is really fun. I always thought it'd be fun to like get someone else who wants to play the game that way, and then try and put on good matches and be like, all right, like okay, like, like on Eric, Discord. Eric yeah, I think I, I was mentioning doing it with Eric or whatever. But we'd be on Discord, and then we'd be like, like okay, okay, now you take me the outside, take me outside, and throw me around outside a little bit. Okay, pump me up, pump me up. Um. Yeah. Anyway. We're gonna go to WrestleMania next year. I don't know. It's in Hollywood. Uh, I don't know if I can get tickets because they're really expensive, but I would totally go. I would absolutely go. But yeah. What if we could only get one ticket? Would you? Would want, I go would or send want, you? Would you want me to have it? No, I keep it. It's mine. <laughs> it's my ticket. Are you crazy? <laughs> but I got I got the ticket. Yeah, to give to me. Easy. Oh, how my brain gonna wrap my head around that? Oh, I did it. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> oh, what's that? Get that WrestleMania chair. Yeah, that'd be well, nothing. We were... Sitting in the first, what are the first three rows of uh, of what? WrestleMania? That'd be a thing. Yeah, Easy Allies have some WrestleMania folding chairs. They do. I know. It's not. I don't think they have a WrestleMania. Oh, they have WrestleMania. They have, just, they have just two other pay per views. But, but yeah, they definitely have folding chairs. Mm-hmm. There was a CrossFit gym I went to years ago that had a bunch of WrestleMania, or not WrestleMania, WWE pay per view chairs. And I was like, wait, how do you have that? And they're like, oh, one of our coaches just is always going to those things. And I was like, how? Hmm. How are you doing that? Um, anyway, yeah, I'd love, I'd love to go. It's a, it's a bucket list thing for me to go to WrestleMania. Um, even Double or Nothing is in Vegas, and I was like, ah, I wish things were better, and I would go, but someday. Maybe I'll have my own wrestling event. Oh, my God. And then you need to, you need to go do whatever you need to do. What does that mean? Empty your bowels what does or whatever's that mean? happening. I don't know. T- you said you ate too much. You ate too much, too, I think, though. I'm fine. I'm packing it on. Bulk, baby! Thanks for watching, everybody. <laughs> we did. We the title was figuring it out, and I think we did. So hopefully, you enjoyed all the yeah. weird stuff we played, and us just kind of hanging out and chatting so with everyone. For hanging out, go watch Marvel Mondays, series, yes. the new Monday series on Funhouse. Yeah, I can't stress it enough. You will not be disappointed. Especially this, especially this Monday. This Monday, you should go watch the ones back. But Elise and I were cracking up watching what's coming out I this Monday. Crying. It's Ghost Rider and it comes out this week. No, don't let anyone tell you this stream was a waste of time. <laughs> Thanks for watching everybody. And, uh, and listen to 30 more minutes. And 30 more minutes and ship hits the fan. And ship hits the fan. And uh and if Jacob's streaming or whatever, go go. Just you know, maybe tweet him. support at Lindsay for trying to get Jacob to play World of Warcraft. Warcraft. And that's all we have to promote. You're trying I to think. finish this stream pretty quickly. Are you sure that you don't have to go empty your I gotta uh, I gotta dump in me. <laughs> oh, it must be dice. It must be dice. Oh gosh. Thank you for Thanks supporting so and watching and hanging out and having fun. Yeah, it's been a blast. It's been fun. Maybe we'll do more of these just like chill. What We always try and come up with a plan. We're not very good lazy streamers. 10.34! My Told God! You. She didn't know. Anyway, thanks everybody. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Bye. Have a good Bye. weekend. <laughs>